hello guys welcome back to our channel so hope everyone is fine on that note let's start this video so friends this is a course regarding programming in java week one assignment solutions guys before getting into the video so please make sure that you share this in your whatsapp groups so that it should reach maximum students who are doing this course and everyone will get benefited through this so if you are new to our channel please subscribe our channel like this video and share this with your friends so i hope every solution is 100 percent correct but if you feel there should be any changes please give your opinion in the comment section so we'll try to sort it out so now uh, with more than five years experience we are giving these solutions so we have made sure that we have tested each and every solution but if you have any doubts you can please ask me in the comment section guys now let's see the first solution So first one, which of the following is not not a primitive data type in Java? So for first question, the answer is option C. That is string. String is a non-primitive data type. So mark option C. Now let's move on to the second question. Second one. So they have given a program, Java program, and they are asking the output of the above code. So for second question, the correct answer is option B, that is minus 127. So when I did this in my compiler, I have got option B as the correct answer. So mark option B. Now let's move on to the third question. Guys, please watch the video till the end. If you skip the video, you may miss some content. So do watch full video. So now let's move on to the third question. So third one. Which of the following concept that Java does not support? Does not support. So in the given solutions, I mean given options, the correct answer is option C. That is pointer. So there is no pointer concept in Java. It's only present in, I mean, it's present in C++, but not in Java. Now mark option C. Let's move on to the fourth question now. Fourth one. which of the following is not a keyword not a keyword in java so for fourth question the answer is option c method so import is a keyword super keyword is also exists and also class so the answer is option c method now let's move on to the fifth question guys fifth one So fifth question, so again they have given a program, they are asking the output. So I have did this in my compiler. So then I have got the answer as option A guys. That is 12, 20 and 13. So mark option A. That is first option. Now let's see the remaining solutions. So before getting into this, I want to announce that we have already prepared exam preparation MCQs for programming in Java and also other courses. So in this video, let me brief you about this. So we have three packs available. So the first one is sample pack and the next one is savings pack and the other one is super savings pack guys. So in uh, sample pack, we have made or the MCQs in the form of YouTube videos, so it's a premium access. So you'll not get any PDF, you'll get a video. So it contains nearly 130 plus questions, and the price is very uh, less price, so it is just 89 rupees only. But the validity is only for one month, and the access only for one person who have joined our membership. But the topics coverage is pretty less, and also there is no such option available. That means you have to watch full video right 
and it is also not easy to revise because you have to watch full video in order to revise once again right so if you want to uh, get mcqs in less amount you can choose this otherwise if you want to prepare sincerely for the final exam preparation you can choose any of these two packs uh, the savings pack is uh, pdf you can get pdf access through google link drive i will give this and the number of mcqs is 150 but here the real uh, benefit is you'll get up to three members access that means for this 300 price you'll get up to three persons that means per each person only 100 rupees is taken and you will have the access not one one guys till the exam day so it's very beneficial for you and the topic coverage is medium here so and also the main benefit is uh, the search option is available here and when you compare to the youtube uh, membership here the search option is available and it is also easy to revise because you can search the required question and also you can easily scroll the pdf right and moving on to the final that final pack that is super savings pack it is also a pdf uh, google drive access so here you will get 300 mcqs this is very huge amount of uh, mcqs right so you'll get better preparation if you want to take pdf it's better to take this super savings pack and the price is also less compared to that because here we are charging just 500 rupees only if you see the previous pack here you'll get 150 mcqs per 300 rupees that means double right but if you see here the price should have been 600 because uh, if you double the 300 you, you should have to pay 600 but we are giving for 500 only and it is also for five members access that means with this same uh, 500 rupee you, up to five members can able to access this till the till the exam day so it is also individually 100 rupees is charged so it's better to take this pack and the topics coverage is also very high and the search option is also available so you can search that and also it is very easy to revise because it's a pdf access so you can easy to revise that so you'll get access till the exam day a google drive link is given so if you want to purchase any of the savings or super savings pack just mail me to this given mail i also give the same mail in the description box but if you want sample youtube pack no need to message me guys you can just go to our channel page and there will be a join button so you'll click on that and select 18 pack. that's it you will become members of our channel and you can get access to this video so but as uh, in my perspective it is better to take this 500 pack because you will get more mcqs it's meaningless to just uh, get 100 mcqs or 150 even if it is low price but it's better to take 500 rupees right you can get up to five members access individually it is also 100 rupees only right so now let's get back to the solutions So the sixth question. So they have given matched correct only for JDK it is option one and for B it is two, for C it is three, and for A it is also one. So the option A is the correct answer. So mark option A. Now let's move on to the seventh one. So they have given a program once again they are asking the output so when i did this i have got option c compile compiler error so mark option c now let's move on to the eighth question so in eighth question they are asking same the output so i have got option c false as the answer so mark option c now let's move on to the ninth question so here the answer is option b java c so mark option c now let's move on to the final question of the assignment that is 10th one so here i have got the output as 50 guys that means option a 50 so mark option a 50 so friends these are the solutions regarding week one assignment hope this video helpful for you keep sharing this video with your friends so keep supporting us like this. Until then, be safe, be happy. Thank